Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Virgo December 21, 2022. Challenging aspects in the first half of the day are minor, but potentially irritating. You can feel vaguely unsettled or undecided. Your perceptions may not be as reliable as they usually are, and reading too much into a situation may be more trouble than it's worth. As much as possible, avoid spiraling thoughts and wrestling with regrets or recent decisions. You could be dealing with people who won't budge on a matter or the opposite, lacking the confidence to make a firm decision, and either way, it's frustrating. Or, there can be an inner conflict between a desire to get out and about and a need to stick with familiar people and situations. Avoid flip decisions and try to stay in the moment. Refinements are needed for incomplete or weak plans. As the day advances, you may be surprised at the many options to enjoy yourself, helping you rise above the challenges. A whisper is whistling in the breeze as a new era begins tomorrow. This is because as the heavens turn, each luminary and celestial object has its own orbit. Glorious Jupiter, our great benefic, is one of the most magnificent planets of all and takes 12 years to complete one revolution around the sun. Jupiter is named for the king of the gods, bestowing blessings and miracles from whichever perch he stands upon in the sky. Currently, he is raising his hands in the realm of Aries, causing everyone to pursue their heart's desires with gusto and passion. Taking the lead rather than waiting for others to pursue you, is the MO at this time. Channel this energy into your love life. Put yourself first in your work and life. It might be time to reconsider what you are committing to when Chiron retrograde in Aries squares Venus in Capricorn and sextiles Mars retrograde in Gemini. You may be excited to pursue new opportunities in your private life and your professional journey. But you will need to keep your work and life balance in mind since that is your first commitment. Instead of spreading yourself too thin, let others know when you need to take a step back to focus on your main professional and personal priorities. The moon's last visit to your income sector for the year was always going to be a valuable last chance to check in with where the money is but also to act as a trigger. However, having the moon here during Jupiter's last full day in your work sector and as he is working with Neptune to cement your dreams for the future there is a chance to factor in a better sense of where the money is. You will tend to be more open with your feelings with today's planetary alignment. This is a positive time for you, when you collect new information from above and reposition yourself in the world. Take the opportunity to check in with yourself and establish your health goals for the coming year. With today's transit, you are able to extend your social sphere of healthy relationships. Definitely consider relationships as part of your overall health and wellness. Welcome to the wonderful energy of this day. This number's essence can see you far more competitive than usual. Further, you may notice that you are particularly ambitious in your endeavors today. Use this to the fullest to make significant headway in your career. You're more likely to want to get out and deal with others, making it an opportune time for meetings and sales. Make real progress today. You'll feel great with all that you accomplish. In the same way that having the moon in Libra when the Dwarf Planet series returned yesterday to begin her first deep dive into your needs and priorities in four years was an advantage, so too is having it in your income sector during Jupiter's last full day in your work sector today. As well as sharpening your nose for money and making this a good day for income and job matters, with the moon and Jupiter in harmony this can boost your confidence just as there is a push to believe in what's possible. This could have ongoing implications on the income and job fronts. While the moon's departure from Libra yesterday took the pressure off the planets in your relationship sector, the timing couldn't be better. As well as flushing out any issues, this leaves you with a better sense of what you want from your relationships and what they need from you just a day before Jupiter's return to your relationship sector. The moon's return to your communication sector tomorrow will help to give this a voice. Our eyes in the sky. The Scorpio moon is busy in the early hours of the day today, making connections while we're trying to get some rest. This could lead to an active dream world or restless sleep, 
but even if you're feeling extra fatigued this morning, avoid going overboard with your caffeine intake. Enjoyable experiences, going out with friends, extended shopping expeditions or eating and drinking to excess result in you pushing yourself too far and overdoing things. Remember that this way of behaving can do you harm in the long run, and does not bring any benefits. Do things in moderation, you can still enjoy life but don't slip into bad habits. As we move through the day, the watery Scorpio moon creates a sensitive atmosphere. Your empathic side can be activated by this lunar placement, so carry a protective stone or take time to meditate this morning before you leave the house. Scorpio energy loves to spend time with good people and higher vibrations, so try to connect with the people who lift you up. This lunar placement can make us susceptible to deception, so avoid taking things at face value over the next couple of days. You will handle financial matters with your usual aplomb today and should consider different types of investments. A good idea can mean a successful future. Even if you are just looking for bargains, you'll be able to distinguish between good and bad offers. Take advantage of them before someone else does. Relationship frustrations could come to a head later in the afternoon, so try to avoid arguments with your significant other. Have some fun and give yourself permission to blow off some steam. Be open to the weird tonight, because you'll likely receive the most unexpected surprises. In the morning, Venus in Capricorn squares off with Chiron in Aries, stimulating tension within our relationships. Our prerogative during Venus in Capricorn is to establish relationships rooted in loyalty and mutual advancement. We seek friends and partners who are in it for the long haul, those who we can rely on in trying times. Yet, as Venus squares Chiron, our engagements may fail to fulfill us. We are stuck comparing current allies with people from our past who damaged our trust or broke our hearts. We may fear that solid, dependable relationships are not part of our story, and that on some level, our too muchness destines us to be alone. Conflict now arises within our relationships to test our endurance, and ultimately, our compatibility. We must maintain a cool head to face these challenges. No matter the outcome, this walk through fire will make us more aware of who we want standing by our side. Use this time to renew contacts with your family. They will be pleased and you might even be able to resolve old conflicts, as a mediator or by taking the first step to clear matters up. The constellation is favorable for burying the hatchet once and for all. Helpfully, mid-afternoon, Mars sextals Chiron, allowing us to heal our insecurities through taking action. The Venus Chiron square has stirred up conflict that we have no choice but to face. But during the Mars Chiron sextal, Accepting this trial with grace is the necessary medicine. In some ways, it is the perfect cosmic foil. Discussions allow us to be vulnerable with others without becoming argumentative or confrontational. We can speak up for our needs with courage. Even if we don't have the perfect words, Mars is still retrograde after all, delivering them from the heart will say it all. By harnessing our voices, we overcome our central anxiety that others may only be with us out of obligation and not out of genuine desire.